The changes are happening quickly. Hi, I'm meteorologist Dave Hovde. 805 Webcams Live takes us out to Morro Bay. And you can see the low clouds and the onshore winds that have set up here. Thinking about the weekend, want to know what it looks like at the beach? Check out 805 webcams before you go and get the forecast right here from KSBY.com or our app. Seven day forecast at the bottom of the screen, hourly forecast satellite radar and a lot more on the app for free. Here's what's going on. The interior valleys, daytime highs, probably not hitting 70 degrees. Again, keep in mind just yesterday, we set a record at 96 degrees, so huge change. South coast temperatures also likely not to get to 70 degrees. A lot of early cloud cover, then filtered sunshine and breezy conditions later in the day. This, I think, is the headline. The coastal valleys, places that hit the 90s this week, 100, in fact, in San Luis Obispo, going to be close to 40 degrees cooler. And the west-facing beaches, early low clouds, and then just a cloud-sun mix. Uh, I would call it sunny breaks. We're going to see some of those temperatures in the low 60s plus a breeze. I like winds to be about 15 to 20 tomorrow. We could see some gusts close to 20 and 25. And then on Sunday, the afternoon, 15 to 25 mile per hour winds with some local gusts up to 30 miles per hour. Now, we don't have any advisories here locally because it's really more of a breezy weekend, but elsewhere in California and the region, it's an issue. Everything in blue here is a wind advisory of one kind or another. We could see some wind gusts of 60 and 70 miles per hour, some winter weather at higher elevations. In fact, some power safety shutoffs are possible in the region due to the wind element. Here's the big trough of low pressure and a cold front that cold front doesn't get to the central coast until, say, the middle of the afternoon. Low clouds out there right now. They'll push into the coastal valleys, into the interior valleys. Mist and drizzle possible with that deep marine cloud cover. And as the front comes through in the afternoon, it might clean out some clouds, at least partially. But again, it's going to crank up the winds. So 60s across the board for daytime highs. The interior overnight lows will be in the 40s. At the coast, it's more like 50s for lows. There's not a lot of town to town difference on Saturday. The deep interior makes probably the best run at temperatures near 70 degrees. Beaches near coastal valleys, low 60s away from the beach, some 70s potential in the Santianez and South Coast. There's the extended forecast. Sunday, more sunshine. Temperatures start to pop a little bit. The warmest day in the forecast is Monday. I've changed the extended forecast and cooled it off a little bit after this. I talk about that and a lot more in my story at KSBY.com. Take the KSBY microclimate weather forecast.